from a piece of history to just pieces. This is a hard hit for us because that's the center of our town. A fire ripped through Bisbee City Hall, leaving just the outside walls standing. When I came out and saw it, uh, yeah, tears were in my eyes. Fire crews say the fire started around 1230 last night and started where you see those two black plumes coming out of the windows. Those windows were blown out and the ceiling collapsed. So much flame coming up the top and then an enormous quantity of smoke. Marsha Gibbons lives two doors down and saw the flames burst from the roof. And it would flare up in one place or another periodically. It was pretty impressive. I put a, a ladder and a hose up to my roof, even though we didn't have a lot of water pressure, just in case there were uh, embers. Luckily, no one was hurt and only this building was damaged, but Gibbon says this is so much more than a building. It is an important building in Bisbee. It's the end of an era. Really emotional because this building has been here forever. I remember um, growing up in this neighborhood and it being here. So it's really sad. But historians say the loss, while devastating, doesn't mean the building is totally gone. It was built of concrete with an iron kind of infrastructure. And that's why I think the walls are still standing. And I think that gives us the hope that maybe it can be restored. The Bisbee Fire Department says they got help from nearly half a dozen fire departments in surrounding areas. But without those extra fire trucks and support, this fire could have spread to neighboring homes and been a whole lot worse. Alexa Liaco, KGUN 9, on your side.